<laughs> I did have to get on the carousel. So I'm holding on for dear life. White knuckles. <laughs> I got right up in front of me. <laughs> Way too much fun. Woohoo! Five, four, three, two. Well, as you can tell, we returned to the McCormick Spillman Railroad Park in Scottsdale, Arizona. I promised I would return to show you the Model Railroad Club and take a ride on that beautiful carousel right in front of us. I brought Ray along this time. As you know, he's 82 years old and he tells me he's never been here before. So what do you think so far? I think it's fantastic. <laughs> you know, I grew up around railroads and I think the preservation of of the railroad as you see it here is fantastic. That's quite the experience, isn't it? Yes, it is. It'll be a lot of fun. I'm going to take you on the train, I'm going to take you on the carousel, we become kids again. <laughs> There's way too much fun here in the Corbin Stillman Railroad Park, the 1950s carousel. Absolutely awesome. Man, oh man. So this is the Ruth and Hartley Barker Exhibit Hall, a model railroad club in Scottsdale, Arizona at the McCormick Stillman Railroad Park. This is so beautiful. This building is 10,000 square feet of model railroading. You can see just the beauty and all the hard work and the craft of this place. Just gorgeous. Wow. Doesn't look like this particular layout is running today, only the first one is, but it's still beautiful. This takes hours upon days, months, and years to build. I had three big layouts, and I say big, but they were small compared to this. My biggest one was an 8x12 HO layout. Last one I had was N gauge, but this is incredible. So up close and personal here, this is behind the roundhouse. I mean, this is built to scale and of course it looks just incredible. And the closer you get to this, the more real it becomes. For example, that bus does not look fake, <laughs> it looks real. So now we're looking down upon the city. This is more of an industrial area. It kind of looks like it's going into the, the yard, so to speak. You can see where the roundhouse was down there in the back. 
and all the trains and cars lined up along, getting ready to go on the round table, or turntable as it might be, heading into the roundhouse. Here we go. This is end scale here. So with end scale being a little bit smaller, you can certainly add more buildings, more communities, more trains, more track, and about half the amount of space that you would on the HO. Absolutely beautiful. And there's the train up top runs around the perimeter of the the building. Matter of fact, when we go into Hartley's, you're going to see the same thing. Hartley's has a train that runs around the perimeter of the snack shop there. Pretty cool. So Ray and I just went through the model railroad club. We have to keep the masks on, so I apologize. It's for safety, of course. And I gotta tell you, this is a lot different than the last one that I was in when they had it at the other end of the park. Now they have it a little, I guess a little bit more secure, obviously for the little kids that come in here, and the protection of all of the models and all of the trains. It's just amazing how much different this looks than the other one. It's a thousand percent better, just absolutely gorgeous. What do you think of it, Ray? Incredible. I mean, I've never seen such a collection in my life. And all the way everything moves, <laughs> the tunnels and bridges. All the different gauges, the N, yep. the S, the O, and the HR. Yep. And all in one place. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, here's your first narrow gauge ride, man. I'm looking forward to this. this is awesome. I have to tell you, Doug, having been through most of this park with you today, I can't believe what is put into this place to make it such an enjoyment for not only uh, like you and I, but also for parents and kids. It's just incredible. Yep, it is. It's an awesome ride. Here we go. Okay, so as I mentioned to you, Ray, we're going to go in the tunnel. This is usually when all the kids scream, so you might want to hold your ears. <laughs> I have to tell you, I get scared in tunnels. <laughs> well, this one gets pretty dark, but it's a, it's a lot of fun. It's you keep cool. your hands off me when you're getting into the tunnel. Here we go. There's the whistle blast, the warning blast as we go into the partnership tunnel. Here it is. How cool is that? Here we go. scared at all.
So we just finished up the tour of Scottsdale's McCormick-Stillman Railroad Park and we're about to embark on this great adult hot dog meal from Hartley's and we're going to test it out let you know how it is. For $5, I bet it's really, really good. Manja. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. Really good. You get a hot dog, you get chips, and a 24 ounce drink of your choice. So it's pretty good, not bad. So just a beautiful day here today with Ray. Ray's first time here. Thank you for joining us today. If you like the video, Press the like button, the subscribe button, share it with your friends, and thanks again. God bless you all.